Well, here we are. We are crossing over the Thames from my house in South London on the way to Gatwick Airport because I'm going to Barcelona. I am heading through Gatwick and to Spain to do a climb. Well, I'm here in the hotel. I've landed in Barcelona. It's about half past ten. The train, train. The plane was very delayed. Um, but that's fine because I'm not in a massive rush, except I'm quite hungry now and I have to go up at 5 a.m. But more importantly, let's just show you the room. How beautiful is this? Now, this room was booked for me. I can say I absolutely would have chosen it. It's new, it's clean, it's fresh, it's beautifully done. It's perfect size for me. Little toilet there, gorgeous shower. What a great idea because you won't see the dirt from the grate. And then that's me looking rather bedraggled in the mirror. So, we have a five o'clock start tomorrow, so I need to I just get myself in bed, really. I really wanted a drink and to go for something to eat, but I'm not going to now. I'll save that maybe for tomorrow. Night. Good morning. It is ten to six, or is it ten to five? Ten to five. And we're heading to work. Okay, so here we go. We are on day one. Let me just stop. Oh, is that playing on Netflix? So, because I've got that playing on my phone down here while I pack up my kit because I am going to spend, I've just finished the hair and makeup for the client that I'm working on. She's gone off to do what she needs to do um, on, her, on her job today. And I'm not going with her for touch-ups. I'm not allowed in where she's working. So I am going to hang out in the hotel. We're right on um, oh, the main, one of the main streets, not the Rambus. I can't remember what one of the beautiful main streets of Barcelona I'm going to show you in a minute. But for now, I'm going to get around to unpacking all her suitcases and getting those loaded up into her wardrobe. So just making everything neat and tidy and fresh for her. Packing my kit down, ready for touch-ups tonight. I'm going to be redoing her makeup at 6 p.m. But so I'm just gonna get it cleaned up, get it packed down, get her room ready, and then I'm gonna get some breakfast, and then I'm gonna head back to my hotel, and maybe get an hour of sleep. I think I've had about four hours sleep from landing late, and then getting up at about four. So. First try of the Louboutin red lipstick on my client. I mean, look at that packaging. Do you think you might be paying for the packaging rather than the lipstick? And has anyone else used it and seen any amazing differences? I'm curious. I was so hungry I had to get some room service just to get myself going for the day. Oh, it's so noisy, but I feel like I can use my camera because I just feel a bit of a twat. My hotel's just behind me, and that's Gaudi's house. Gaudi? Behind there. Um, so I'm in a great location, and it's next door to Starbucks. Unfortunately, Starbucks isn't open, and I start work at 3 a.m. <laughs> Um, but it is over when I get home, so that's fine. And I'm off for my break now, so I've got a break for a couple of hours and I'm going to eat something healthy and have a wander down. I won't go as far as the beach, I'll probably just go as far as the plaza and have a little mooch. So, it's day two, slightly later start this time, it started at 6.30, although I'm not actually starting yet because my client's still in the shower, but I'm in her room, just got her dress out, got my kit all unpacked and ready, and just waiting for that coffee to come. A little bit of Barcelona Gothic Quarter, mainly because of these amazing balconies with the beautiful plants, looking lush and old and authentic. And then the sex shops down below, kind of put a twist on that a little bit. half nine-ish. Let's just look at my watch. No, it's not. It's ten to nine. That's completely lie. Ten to nine, I've just finished, so I'm gonna probably grab something light to eat 
and a drink. I was trying not to drink, but I think I am going to drink. Also, we've got a late start tomorrow and it starts till 9.30, so that's a whole 12 hours time. I could actually go out in that time. Morning, so I'm on my penultimate day in Barcelona. I'm just heading to my client's hotel to get her ready. And then I think I might try and use her spa because there's a really nice swimming pool in her hotel. There's a nice one of mine and it's actually outside so I probably should go to my one. I feel like I just want to try her one and see what it's like because she doesn't have time to use it. Also I'm going to go and get breakfast at hers as well just to see what her breakfast is like because she doesn't use it so she's just allocated it to me. So yeah, living my best life. It's Sunday, I had a few drinks last night, went for dinner by myself. Um, they free pour here. I think I had a half a pint of gin for my last drink. Definitely feeling that today. I regret it a little bit. There wasn't any need to drink alone. Again, couldn't stop myself. Story of my life. So anyway, yeah, just walking down south. I guess that you'd be, if you were here, you'd be heading south towards the beach. That's the direction I'm going. I'm coming up to the big um, square in the middle of Spain, uh, middle of Barcelona, the, the Playa del Catalunya, is it? Terrible, terrible pronunciation and memory considering I've been here a few times. But anyway, here we go. I haven't done my hair or my makeup. I've put sun cream on. I've done a little bit to my brows and a teeny bit of mascara on my lashes. finished another makeup. I'm alone in this massive restaurant. Um, I think I'm eating earlier than most people but I've got a really early start tomorrow so go for the salad which looks lovely. I'm embarrassed even talking on this camera in here. Ooh. I'm downstairs at the bottom of the spa in the hotel because upstairs on the roof is so hot and I am just not a very good being in the heat person, it makes me get a headache and I burn really easily. So, and I'm never going to get a tan, so what's the point of ever trying? So, wow, I look bad. Wow, this is, this is bad. Um, anyway, so I'm down here for a swim because I've checked out of my hotel. I'm in my client's hotel and just killing time. I did a hair and makeup this morning, now she's at a conference, and then I've got to go back there at two o'clock to finish it, and then I've got to catch my flight. So, this seems like a pretty good way to kill the time. I've got some time to kill before my flight, so I'm just checking out the beautiful rooftop on top of the Mandarin Oriental, where I've been working with my client. And time to chill out because I am very tired. Nights of no sleep are not doing me good, but I'm heading off now into my taxi and back to the airport. So goodbye Barcelona until next time. Thank you for treating me so well. It's been a great trip and I'll see you on the next job. <laughs>